Hey, my name is Zach, and I wanted to show you a pretty easy tutorial on how to render images in GIMP. Now basically what this means is you're cutting something out of the image. This is something you might want to do if you're trying to put yourself on like a background or something like that. So first we're going to open up GIMP. And once GIMP opens, we're going to go to File and Open. I'm going to navigate to my desktop where my image is and open that up as well. Now I suggest zooming in first. So now that I've scrolled up, you see the head here. I'm just going to do the head for now just so I can basically show you how to render quickly. First we're going to go up to Tools and go to Paths. Now you're going to start clicking around what you want to cut out. These little points are called anchors. It's okay if you go a little bit sloppy with this because we can refine the edges later. We just want to make sure that we're getting everything in. If you get a little bit of the background, it's okay. and we'll finally click this other point to finalize the path. So now first we're going to go up into Select and do From Path. Now it looks like there's marching ants all over it. So now we're going to go to the Layer tab. We're going to go to Transparency and hit Add Alpha Channel. This is a really important step. If you don't add the Alpha Channel, it's not going to work properly. Now we're going to go up to the Select menu and go Invert. You'll notice that the image does not change. Now in order to get rid of this background, what we're going to do is go to Edit and go down to Clear. And we'll notice that it clears everything around it. So next we're going to go and select the Rectangle tool and we can just make a box around it. Now I'm going to go up to Image and do crop to selection. And now that's the only thing in the image. I did a pretty good job through here making sure not to get any of the background but if you did you can zoom in even a little bit more and you can take the eraser tool here. My name is Zach and I just showed you how to easily render images in GIMP. Thanks for watching.